Summer vacation is just about here, so we're going to talk hotels this morning. A good one can help make your trip wonderful. A bad one can just about ruin it. Indeed. So let's get some tips from a man who knows exactly what you're looking for. He's Anthony Malchiori. He's host of Travel Channel's new series, Hotel Impossible. There's the service entrance. It just kind of looks all beat up and just gives me a bad feeling. The captain's wheel needs to be painted as well. And it's the first thing I see when I pull up. Why isn't it painted? Okay, where's the front desk? You got this cone, it's filthy. You have a newsstand that has no newspapers, flower pot that's dead. If I'm a customer, I feel like no one cares. So, you know, they're not gonna care about me. Anthony, good morning. Good morning. So what's the first thing? I mean, you, you notice the paint missing. <laughs> what else do you notice when you walk into a hotel? Well, I can notice everything I need to know about a hotel by the parking lot. So when the I pull parking up, lot. The, the parking lot, it's like the bathroom in a restaurant. You look, dirty bathroom, mm. dirty, dirty restaurant, bad food. You walk into a parking lot or you drive into a parking lot and the, the lines aren't painted and it's chipped, the wall's chipped. You can just tell it's not going to be a good experience. So don't get out of the car. Don't get out of the car. Keep just driving. keep going. <laughs> or, when you, or when you see a bellman and a bellman doesn't look in the eye and he just doesn't look uh, well groomed, your room is probably dirty. How much, how, what does the rating system tell us? How much does that matter in your opinion? Well, the rating system years ago, the AAA, three, four, five diamonds, that was a big deal, still a big deal. Mm -hmm. But really, when you go online, 80% of customers, go, uh, guests go online to look right. for a room. So if you see a five star rating, but the customer or the guest rated it three stars, mm -hmm. are you going to that hotel? Probably no. not. Probably not. So really the reviews online, that rating system is really becoming the more popular rating system. Well, do you, you, go ahead. I was going to say, do you get a better deal by going online to the Expedia's, the Hotels.com's of the world, or going mm. through the hotel itself and asking for a deal? You, you always shop. You always go around. You always look at the Expedia's and, the, and uh, Hotels.com. But go to the hotel's website. You will always find the best price on the hotel's website. Let's talk about some of your big tips here, mm -hmm. okay, because you have five of them. Mm -hmm. You talk about spot cleaning. Mm -hmm. Why? When I walk into a hotel, if you make me feel comfortable and you make me feel like you have everything under control, I'm probably less likely to do spot cleaning. But if I feel that there's a problem, like you see in that clip right there, if there's a problem, then I am going to clean with my this Lysol. This is you cleaning, not the maid. I'm cleaning with Lysol. I'm cleaning the toilet. I'm cleaning the handle. I'm cleaning the remote control. So, so those are the, the items that you would say, the, the handles on the doors, the, handle, the toilet, mm -hmm. and the remote control. And the handle on the toilet, the little uh, fresh And item. anything else you would oh. spot clean? Um, I spot clean the desk. I spot clean the desk. Hmm. I make sure the desk is nice and clean. I like my desk nice and clean. But it really is up to you. Depending on how far my cutiometer goes off, depends on the, the hotel. If the hotel's very clean and they've, they're, they're very focused, I'm probably less of, of a germaphobe. But if not, if they're not paying attention to the details, then I am full on germaphobe. Quickly, let's run through <laughs> some of these other tips here. Free internet, this is a big one. You, you stay at a relatively it. nice hotel and they, 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 sometimes they don't give it to you. It's the number one complaint in America for corporate travelers that they don't get free internet when they're in four or five star hotels. When people were traveling and they were using pens to write, you got a free pen. So now everybody writes on the internet. Why not give me free internet? You say always get two wake up calls and arrive early for that complimentary breakfast. Why get there early? Oh, get there early because everybody goes down. If it's a 9 o'clock, uh, if you have a 9 o'clock appointment, everyone's downstairs at 8 o'clock. So if you get there at 6.30, 7 o'clock, it's just a lot more comfortable. And everything looks fresher and everything's better. And finally, you say use social media to your advantage. How do you do that? Go on social media and you really find great discounts on social media today. Everyone wants you to like their Facebook page. Mm. So they will give you a discount, amenity, and upgrade if you go on their social media page. Do you complain on social media if you don't like something? Do you send out a tweet or something else? You always give the hotel an opportunity to correct the problem. You always go to the top. If they don't correct the problem, go to social media. Anthony Melchiori, we love the name of the new series. Thank, Thank you very you. much. And Thanks the power of social media. Yeah.